Hi, this is Ryan with uh, Blair Technology Group. In this video, we'll be taking a look at how to reset Google Chrome as well as uh, clean up uh, any add-ons or extensions that might have been installed. Uh, this is a companion video for cleaning up your machines part one and two. Uh, so you can basically just substitute the information in here for what's in that video. We were using Internet Explorer in that video. Uh, so the very first thing we we'll want to do is go ahead and open Google Chrome. Uh, once you, I've already installed some some junk and some toolbars here, as you'll see across the bottom and across the top here. Uh, so if you see a bunch of these stuff or it's running really slow, uh, you'll definitely want to reset it because it certainly will speed up your internet. And if it's really bad, it it could be significant, 15, 20 seconds per web page possibly. So what we want to do is go to the options, these three little bars here on the very top right hand corner. Once you've located that, just go ahead and left click on these bars and this will bring up the options menu. Uh, so you have a bunch of stuff to choose from. We we'll want to go to settings here, which will be the fourth option from the bottom. And this will take you into the actual browser settings. First thing we'll want to take a look at in the settings menu is on startup. This is the setting that tells the browser what web page that you want to open right off the bat as soon as you open up Google Chrome. Uh, right now I do have it just set to google.com uh, you can put in whatever you'd like. Uh, you'll see there's a little box right below there. You can type in whatever website you'd like if you use Google, AOL, Yahoo, etc. Uh, whatever site you're comfortable with. I uh, the only thing we're really doing is just making sure it's not set to something crazy, some website you never heard of to try to get you to buy something or anything like that. Uh, if that is the case, you just want to remove it and put in something you're familiar with. Once this looks OK, uh, you can just click the OK button. And then we'll want to go to uh, advanced settings down here at the bottom. Uh, this will open up a several more options here and we'll want to scroll down to the very bottom and we're looking for the button that says reset browser settings once you locate this you can just mouse over it and left click it uh, once you do left click it it is going to bring up a window uh, that says restore browser settings and in this window it's going to have a description of exactly what it's going to do here uh, reset your home page, new tab page, and search engine, disable your extensions, and unpin all tabs. Basically, it's just setting it back to just like it was when you first uh, downloaded it. And uh, once you have this set, you can just go ahead and click reset. And then you'll just want to close Google Chrome down completely and then go ahead and reopen it. And as you can see, all the toolbars and everything are gone. Uh, they're not actually removed completely, uh, but they are all turned off. And now we're going to go ahead and just uh, go through the process here of actually removing them. So we'll want to go down to uh, settings again. And then just left click on settings. And uh, what we're looking for is uh, not the actual settings, but the extensions, which will be right above the settings. We just want to click on extensions here in the top left hand corner and, and you'll see all the uh, add on stuff um, that's not necessarily included with the browser. And you can see they're grayed out because they have been shut off. And uh, at the end, you'll see a little trash can and that's to delete it. So we'll just want to remove anything that you don't recognize or you don't think you would need. In Google Chrome, there's pretty much nothing installed. The only thing there is Google Docs, uh, which you do need. Uh, you should be able to essentially remove everything out of this window. Once you have everything removed here, you can just close down this tab and you should be good to go after this. Uh, this is the only place to find these extensions. So once this is clear, everything should be fine. Uh, so this will conclude the video. I uh, hope this helped. If you have any issues or questions, certainly feel free to give us a call Monday through Friday at 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Uh, number is 855-BLAIR-TG. Uh, again, that number is 855-BLAIR-TG. Uh, Thank you. Have a good day.